What's going on vloggers, bloggers, and everyday toilet users? It's time for another episode of the Toilet Vlog. So I know I haven't done a video in a while. <coughs> I had some other videos that I meant to upload where I was like distilling some stuff. It was just like apple juice and what do you call it? Um, molasses wash. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, the, the still that I have was really shitty and small. It ended up puking and it came out all brown and shit. And I had to redistill it to even get like one jar of like clear like liquor. And it, it just sucked. So I just said fuck it. I didn't even upload it. Uh, but other than that, we'll get back to the distilling and brewing stuff later because I'm going to be doing stuff about that in later episodes. But to talk about my life like I always do on this uh, this channel. Uh, I don't even remember the last episode that I actually uploaded, and I didn't care to go look back. I'm actually at work right now. I'm on lunch break. But yeah, so um, the last time that I think I uploaded a video, uh, I don't know if I talked about it or not, but me and Autumn are married now. Um, what do you call it? We got a new car. Uh, it's a Nissan Rogue. It's really nice. It even has like a little built-in sub in the back which is really cool because it's like circular so it sits in the uh where like the spare tire was or is on top of the spare tire so that was kind of cool and i'm a, i'm really into like stereo stuff like that so um yeah a lot of other stuff has been going on um just had wesley a little while ago he's back on honor row really proud of my little genius uh i've been looking into um uh, that new space telescope that they just launched, that's going to be cool. Uh, cool science stuff that I'll probably talk about in one of the next videos or something. Um, my uncle moved into town and is constantly blowing me up to build furniture for him. But he did get me the T500 distiller, which is like an $800 still. But he got it for like 500 bucks on Amazon. So, And that will be in one of the later videos as well, too. Because I don't want to just do vlogs. I also want to do, on this channel at least, like, when the summer starts coming around, I want to start doing, like, more of the toilet vlog, kitchen editions, talking about the electric smoker I got, doing recipes like that, uh, trying out barbecue sauces. Like, I made this Alabama white sauce barbecue that's kind of like a mayonnaise, mayonnaise base with, like, apple cider vinegar and spices and horseradish and mustard and i'm absolutely obsessed with that I put it on fucking everything um it's probably what's been giving me hardcore gas i mean it's been bad i'm like locked in the van because it's cold as hell and it's january you know which is also another thing they got me in fucking uh saint joe today instead of bloomington uh which really sucks because i really like the bloomington area it's just i'm just i've done it so much that i just know where everything is if i gotta take a shit or pee i can find a bathroom like that I come out here in the sticks and I think, oh yeah, there's a boda party around the street. But no, it's been gone because I haven't been over here in six months. So it's it's kind of bullshit. I'm parked at a Casey's right now. But still, I mean it kind of sucks. Uh right in my third year here almost in July. So thinking about maybe branching out pretty soon. I really don't want to quit. I mean I like my job. You know, I kind of just got over listening to the news all the time because that kind of got boring after a little while and I've got Audible and I've listened to like 12 books now I think 8 more realistically I mean um, but yeah I've just been working uh, back to my uncle for a second like yeah he loving to death his family and everything like that but oh my god the man can talk more than me which is saying something because, like, every time we're over there, he's so self-centered, just talks about himself and yada yada. And, I mean, I know how to get him to, like, move on in a conversation by kind of buttering him up and shit. But, like, yeah, I mean, like, he moved here and all he does is complain about how cold it is because he's from Texas or Florida or wherever the fuck and he's talking about moving. I don't know, but I don't know. I've been going over there almost every single fucking day. Look, he's texting me right now. I don't even know what the hell it says. Something about going to Costco. He, like, gives me life updates. <laughs> Like, seriously, just woke up, one text. Uh, taking a shit, another text. Well, I don't know about that, but still, it's, you know, I'm just going with it. Because, I mean, I am helping him out. 
his family. He did get me the still, which I wouldn't have been able to afford by myself for a very long time. Um, but yeah, you know. Um, I don't know what else to talk about. Um, a bad note, Autumn ended up losing her job over some bullshit. And what it was is that Luna got COVID. But don't worry, she's fine. Um, she had like a slight cough. It didn't really get raspy or really hard or nasty. and But she had it for like two, three weeks. And so Autumn was off of work. And I basically, because I don't go around anybody, I just kept my mask on. No, Tegan's texting me. Oh, well, we'll get back to him too. <coughs> <coughs> well, yeah, I just kept my mask on because I work alone. You know what I mean? And I couldn't afford to not work. And, you know, but neither me or Autumn tested positive. So she goes back to work and for like three days. And then all of a sudden she gets a kidney stone. So she she's out of work and they tell her not to work. And then they straight up fire her ass because she's out of work because of the kidney stone. Even though she had proof from Carl saying, hey, I can't work or lift heavy things and stuff like that. But they fired her anyway. So that's fucked up. <laughs> she actually had the surgery for the kidney stones and that went successful. So she's fine. Which is, is great because she, she has a lot of medical problems. I mean, you know, she's got the hernia and some other stuff like that. But that was one of the big things because she was, like, miserable like, every day for, like, months and months and months. But now all that's gone, so, which is good. Uh, other than that, trying to think what else the hell's going on in my life that I can think of. I don't, I don't know, man. It's just... It's been a blur. I don't even know what happened in January. All I did was work. <laughs> I've been getting like, I've been doing six days in a row, one day off, six days in a row, and then all of a sudden I have Wesley. So I haven't really been able to do a couple of things that I personally want to do, but I'm not, I don't want to be selfish when it's the weekends that I have Wesley, you know? And so that's another thing is that I'm going to hopefully talk to his mom about this winter, um, keeping him for, you know, longer than just the two days, maybe do like, you know, like a week. Or maybe even a month. And he was talking about wanting to like work out. And lose a bunch of weight. Holy shit this video is almost 8 minutes. Um, but yeah that's going to be another summer project. But yeah like I said. I'm going to go ahead and end it here. But like I said look forward to uh, more videos. I'm going to do like a grain to glass beer. I'm also going to do some more wines. I'm actually doing a strawberry mead that's fermenting right now. And it's basically almost done. And I'm going to test that out, or taste test that, maybe do a video of that. And then, yeah, like I said, when the summer rolls around, start doing, like, smoking videos. Excuse me. Um, and, but yeah, look forward to more videos of stuff. I know I've been neglecting this channel, but, yeah, let's go from there.